Good morning, friends. Maggie slept on my legs pretty much all night, or right by my legs. And if I ever just like put my hand down when we were sleeping to like scratch her or something, she would just come up and nuzzle right up in my neck. She'd lick my face and nuzzle right up with me. Didn't you last night? You liked that. She, guys, she won't leave my side. I went to go to like the bathroom in the middle of the night, which is in my room, and she jumped off the bed and had to come into the bathroom with me. And here's a perfect example. We, we just played fetch in the morning for like 30 minutes. Um, and this is a perfect example of like my kind of dog is like, all right, I got the ball. Let's go run. Let's go hike. Blah, blah, blah. Crazy. Whereas here's how Buckley spent his morning. <laughs> Good Buckley. You can tell Buckley is, he's not giving me kisses. He's not licking me. He's clearly a little bit uh, jealous. And he's like, what is this young little crazy thing doing in the house? But it's okay, Buckley. You can continue living your lifestyle. I won't forget about you. I love you so much. And we'll be out of here in about five weeks. You can get back to your normal schedule right here. So I got in touch with V-Dog, the big mainstream vegan dog food brand that you can find in a lot of pet stores. And they agreed that we can work together, which is so awesome. So I can't wait to try their product and for Maggie to try their vegan food. Wow, you scarf that down. But until the shipment of the V-Dog comes in, I'm just gonna use Buckley's food. I'll be honest, it is not vegan. This is the food my parents feed Buckley. But because I'm home now and because we're getting the V-Dog, I'm actually gonna start feeding her the V-Dog and transition Buckley to see if he can get on the V-Dog too so my parents don't have to buy any animal products for Buckley either. So that is the plan thus far. Yeah, good girl. She is a pro catcher, oh my gosh. Let's see if you like banana smoothies. Oh, she likes this movie, all right. All right, so I booked a vet visit just for a checkup. She's got all of her shots, and other than being clinically obese, according to the records, she's 60 pounds. The vet today will tell us how much she has to lose. I know you don't want to be in the car, but we're about to go on a hike. Who knows if you have ever been on a hike? I'm so excited, you have the best time. I brought her ball. We're gonna go hike and run around for a bit, maybe meet some dogs and then go to the vet. I am having the greatest time ever as a dad and a friend to a beautiful, beautiful lady. I think today's the best day of my life. I have a dog and we're off leash on a trail in the sun in Southern California playing fetch. I, I, I've, I've hit a higher peak, my friends, than I honestly think I've ever hit in my life. Hey! <laughs> okay, I am learning so much. She she wants to just keep going and like the instinct in her as a cattle dog is like throw the ball again go further and she's just running and sprinting but I can tell that she's just overheating and even though her like mind is physically fit and wants to push herself her body is just not fully prepared for that like she is she is obese I looked at her records this morning that they gave me from the shelter she's clinically obese 
She's 60 pounds and I think she needs to lose about 15. So that's a lot, maybe 10, I don't know. I'm gonna take her to the vet today. So they'll probably tell me, but yeah. So we, we walked for like 20 minutes and now I wanna walk back to the car cause I left the water in there. I just don't wanna push it any further cause she's clearly so hot, but I think she's having an amazing time. I don't know if she's ever done this before. She's in the swing of it now, but she was really kind of confused and just searching all around when we first got to the trail. Who knows if she hasn't seen dirt and rocks in like a really long time. This is oh, so awesome. She must be pretty dehydrated from the shelter because she drank about four bowls of water. Hey, we're putting it in here. I know last night she drank like four bowls and this morning she kept drinking as well. And as you can see, she is very thirsty. Um, so that's good, she's hydrating up and she's peeing and pooping a lot, which is awesome. Her poops are solid. They're not diarrhea-y at all. Oh, she's just so easy. It's been so great. Here you go, my love. Yeah, right from the source. Amen. That's my girl. go. The saga of getting tangled begins. Who would have thought? It's hard to vlog and have a dog at the same time. Um, but yeah, we just got our harness so we don't have to use that neck leash they gave me at the shelter anymore, which is great. She's, I think she'll be much happier with this. I got her a new leash made out of soy uh, recycled fibers or something. I got some vegan treats. There's a blueberry one and then a peanut butter cookie one. And this is so fun. First visit to the dock. She's definitely like, get me out of here. Back onto the trails, right? But we'll be out in no time. I'm sure there's nothing wrong with you. Even though we just weighed her. She weighs 71 and a half pounds. Oh my God. We have to get her down to like 55 or something. Maybe 45, who knows. You're a big girl. I know, you're crying. You're such a baby. I know. The doctor's no fun. I know, but we have to do it once and then you'll be okay. It's just a checkup. And then we'll go back outside and go see Buckley. Yeah, you're doing so great, baby. I stopped by this dog park. I grew up playing baseball here and soccer and sports. This is where I literally grew up, right by my house, Barrington Park. And I've always seen this dog park and there's always a million dogs, but this is the first time I've gotten to take my dog here and we are having so much fun. Oh, you are too good. Look at how pretty all these pups are. Hi. 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 Hi, baby. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. You're very popular, Maggie. You're very popular here with all the puppies. <laughs> Look at you. You like that water, huh? Hi. 
Come here. Come here. Good girl. Drop it. Give me the ball. Come here. Come here. I think she is going to pass out. Which is good because I need to edit. Want to go make a smoothie at home? Give me a kiss. Not a bad lunch. That is freaking beautiful. Oh, and there's Maggie taking a pee. You know you're a parent when you get like proud and excited when your child pees in the proper place. Since peeing on my bed yesterday, she hasn't gone to the bathroom in the house at all. So I think she's gotten the picture. What do you think of Maggie? I like her so much. She's a beautiful woman. My mom went and walked Buckley for a very long time today so he doesn't get too jealous. Like, how are you doing? But he'll be so excited that I got a boot over. You found another ball, but you're still panting from all of our exercise. You need to rest. She's gonna injure herself if I keep pushing her to the amount that she wants to go exercise because her body just can't support it because she's so fat. So she'll like injure a joint or something. So gotta take it slow. Today was extremely active. I'm exhausted. Oh, I can't even. She just took a nap on my bed as I edited. It was lovely. Now, getting a little stretching and abs in before jacuzzi time. She still hasn't jumped in the pool after last night, I think. I don't think you'll make that mistake again, Maggie. Oh. Thanks to everyone who has sent us love today and yesterday. You guys are in love with her too, and I'm so happy. You're the best. <sighs> yeah, meditating is is gonna be hard. I'll have to do it early in the morning when she's sleeping. I just fed her and did like 15 minutes of training and it was a spiritual experience. I'll show you uh, tonight before we go to bed what I taught her and see if she still does the commands even without food now, if she just does them. It was so cool. I taught her how to like sit and then go down and lay down and then I can walk away and say stay and she'll stay there. Whereas before she would just run towards me. So oh, it was so cool and now fed her and now it's playtime. She really likes to play. <laughs> I'm gonna go take a shower. Watch when I walk away. Just a few feet. She starts freaking out. Stay. It's okay. <laughs> She's looking at me like, do not go, you motherfucker. I want you in my sight. Stay. Stay. It's okay. I'm just gonna take a shower. I'm just going right in there. It's okay. Hey Maggie, this right here? Good girl. Very good girl. I like that, that lie down. That was good. And this right here is called a burrito. Okay Maggie? Yeah. So this is my healthy dinner tonight. Another amazing salad. The combo of I'm still making that Caesar salad dressing alive that Lauren made and a burrito filled with this. Rice, quinoa, green split peas, just leftovers. Broccoli, nooch. I didn't really cook anything. I just prepared and put things together. Put it in the microwave, easy.
What do you think? Day one, we've been together for over 24 hours. Do you like me? Are we gonna be friends? Will we get along? I think we'll get along just perfect. I love you, baby. Much love. Dream Extreme from the two of us. This is the vlog now. I'm no longer the main character. I have a co-star now. I love you. Good night.